Welcome to the Clarity Financial Monday Midday Update. I'm Brent Clanton, executive producer for The Lance Roberts Show. Yesterday was the 17th anniversary of the Enron debacle. Do you remember what you were doing on December 2nd, 2001? We'll be speaking with Bethany McLean, the New York Times bestselling author of The Smartest Guys in the Room, The Amazing Rise and Scandalous Fall of Enron, and her newest book, Saudi America, The Truth About Fracking and How It's Changing the World. That's later today. Check Lance Roberts' article published this morning on misdiagnosing the risk of margin debt. It's on realinvestmentadvice.com. Earlier today, Lance was the interviewee for George Cronbacker's Savage Money podcast, which we'll share later in the month. But here's a snippet from that conversation. Well, Lance, Savage Nation is ready for your difference-making tip. What do you have for them? <laughs> um, my dad used to always say that the best, the best moves in life are when you sit down and shut up and listen. Mm. Um, <laughs> and listen to what the market's telling you. This is the thing. The best piece of advice is, is always this, have cash. If you have cash, it gives you opportunity to do something. If you're fully invested and you're just riding the markets up and down, the problem is, is when you have opportunity, those opportunities occur after a sell-off. But if you've ridden the market down because you didn't take any profits earlier, you didn't sell high, you can't buy low. So always have some cash available for profits, uh, for, for opportunity, sorry. Um, the other thing is, is take profits on a regular basis. Again, going back to our gardening analogy, when you buy a position and it moves up a lot, take a little money off the table. Yes, you can, you can still be in the position. It can still grow. But if you harvest on a regular basis, when the position stops going up or you wind up in something old like a General Electric, you've already harvested some of that gain. So you don't give back everything you made. The worst thing you can do is turn a winner into a loser and then sell it. That interview will be available on realinvestmentadvice.com. We'll let you know when it's ready. Plenty of other projects are in the works, too, including Danny Ratliff's series of Money Minutes for the New Year, as well as Lance Roberts' return to terrestrial radio Monday, January 7th at 6 a.m. Central Time on AM700, The Voice of Texas. Check out all these stories at realinvestmentadvice.com. And if you haven't yet done so, subscribe to our pro version by clicking on the RIA Pro tab. Be sure to catch the Lance Roberts podcast later this afternoon at 3 p.m. Central on Vimeo, Facebook Live, and YouTube. The links are all at realinvestmentadvice.com. I'm Brent Clanton. Thanks for watching.